Welcome to Big Data Pedia. Today we are going to learn how to install Apache Airflow on Windows OS. So before installing that Apache Airflow, we have to do some configuration with Windows OS. That's we need to enable the Linux configuration. So Windows subsystem for Linux one option is available. We need to enable it, and we have to install that Ubuntu OS or whatever that Linux flavor is available. We have to install. Okay, we'll go with step by step today. So just type. And search for like features so directly it come and just open it and just go to this one just enable this options windows subsystem for linux once you enabled just click ok and then just go to microsoft store there you just type as ubuntu So there it will come. So you can take any one Ubuntu version, or if you need any other Linux flavor, you can select it. I am using Ubuntu. <coughs> so already have installed. So just click launch. It will come like this. So first at the first time, it will be asked that the username and password, and you have to provide the username and password for sudo operations. So I just do sudo operation. And I just enter my password. Okay. Once you enter, as you know very well, you just do so up updates. Apt. I can get update. Already I am in sudo mode, so I just providing the command only. If you are not in sudo mode, you need to mention with sudo apt get update. Okay, it's done because already I have done updates. It takes some time, but and then do upgrade. So everything I just upgraded already, so it's completed very fast. Once it is done, then you have to install normal pip packages so that we need pip packages. So by default, Python three will come now. Once Python three installed, based on the command, you have to install Python packages. So pip. I just check the version now. So I am using at twenty eight is the latest version, and I am using three point six Python flavor. Okay. So now, the based on the same concept. Is now pip install Apache iPhone Airflow. So before install it, we can see is it is installed or not. I have installed a lot of things. There is no Apache Airflow is available. Now I just going to install it. Pip install. Apache, iPhone, Airflow. So installation started, and uh, already I have installed and uh, uninstalled for the testing practice. So again, I am installing now. So just collecting the package for Apache Airflow and successfully installed and come out from this. Now I just going to see pip list again whether it is installed or not. Okay, now it is installed. So with the latest version 1.10.7. So we need to kickstart Airflow edit tb. So the command is Airflow any DB. So already is available. So once it is done, then 
we have to kickstart it. Add flow. Web server. I will port 8080. That I already opened, so I'm just using the same port number and open it. Okay, so host will be open with our local host. I'll just copy. So I'm just going to open it, Chrome, and paste here. Okay, so we have to change this with local host. Okay, once it is kick started, we can see in our Windows system Chrome. Okay, as well, this information will be loaded. Just see that where it is located. Okay, so but it will be available in root mode. Here the slash root. So it will be in airflow here. So this is we can see in this environment as well. Just go to this user ID and select the update and go to the local I think packages in packages you can see if it is Ubuntu it will become with canonical group limited Ubuntu on Windows just click on it and go to not app data local state I guess root TFS and go to root so here you can see the same so this file is available in Windows operating system in this directory so just go back and go to this our home directory and Ubuntu this is my slash home and Ubuntu this is actually my path okay this path is available here I just simply creating the sample file txt we can see here so this is the way we can locate it to windows environment from ubuntu if any data is needed you can directly copy here okay. otherwise you just using this mount operations so if suppose i need to go somewhere some d directory i have to go to some use cases So I would like to come to this directory. Just click on it. If you have a git bash, git bash, you just open it and copy this path and go to this cd slash mnt slash and then paste the path. Okay. Cd. IPL data set. Okay, here you can see. So, like this, with this, this is just mounted. You're just using this slash mount and you can enter to this directory. So, like this, we can interact with our Windows environment with the Linux subsystems. I hope you can understand and uh, you know how to install this Apache Airflow. And uh, later session, we can go with some hands ups in Windows environment. Thank you.